All right, my friends, it's time to go to school with Fox 5, and today we are getting uh, creative as we get an art lesson. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> From Muffalo Potato, and joining us now is Muffalo Potato creator John Massey. Welcome. Thanks for joining us. Hi, Maria. Thanks for having me on today. How you doing? Good, and I love the fact that uh, you have a connection to Southern Nevada. Tell us about that. I do, I do. I lived in Henderson for 15 years. Uh, I had the best time of my life, had a beautiful house and a beautiful life, and uh, my adventures took me everywhere else, but I love coming back and visiting, and I love all my Las Vegas friends. Ah, we'll claim you. You're one of us. All right, I'm loving that. Okay, let's talk a little bit about what we're doing today. Uh, we mentioned it uh, when you did something for Easter, the Easter Bunny. Now you're doing something special for us here at Fox 5. Yes, yes. So today I'm going to show you guys how to draw an elephant in just a few minutes by using nothing but numbers and letters because that's the Muffalo Potato Way. So you need three things. You need a pen. Got you need it? a piece of paper, and you need to watch me, okay. okay? Ready to go. So everybody, here we go. Everybody start with your paper straight up and down just like this. And in the lower right-hand corner, I want you to draw the number nine. Watch me first. It goes around, 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 and back again. Real easy, number nine, just like that. All right. Okay, perfect. Now in the upper left-hand corner, we're going to do a capital E. Watch this. We go across down and back again so it touches the middle of the nine and just bring that little part of the e out just a little bit leave it a little bit short there e nine so far so good so easy okay i'm there Go once for it. There. yep yep once you're finished there let's do a small thin c just like this it's a very skinny c blacking off that e and then when you've got that Right down here beneath the nine, we're going to draw the number eight. Now, the number eight is as easy as two zeros that are really good friends. So we do one zero here and one zero here. That makes the number eight sitting there right down at the bottom of the nine. All right. So far, Maria, you got so it? So far, so good, my friend. Okay, so now we do two small lowercase d's inside each part of the eight. Watch this. We go down and around, down and around. Two little teeny D's, just like that. These are all easy numbers and letters that everybody knows how to do. And it doesn't have to be perfect. It just needs to be fun. So keep that in mind, too. Just to the left, we're going to do the number 11. One, one. Two ones make an 11. Hey, you know something? This isn't looking like an elephant. Everybody turn your page this way real quick. Oh, okay. Sorry. Let's keep, <laughs> that's the fun of Muffalo, but you're doing great. Keep going. We're almost there. I love it. I love it. I wish we could see yeah, it. Oh, that's great. Okay. Great. Let's keep going. We're almost done. All We're right. going to draw a lowercase J coming around just like this. Very easy. J for John. We're going to do a D, lowercase D, at an angle just like that. That forms the trunk of our elephant. These are all numbers and letters. It's super easy. We're going to do two lowercase m's for toes. Nice and convenient at the bottom. And two more letters and we're finished. We're going to draw a C coming around this way to close off the shape. And then a little teeny V to make the tail of the elephant. And oh. look at that. It let me see. That you is did an amazing. amazing. Job. You really can't see it, but I'll I'll send you a copy. Where can we get more information and when can we check out your wonderful videos? I had so much fun on YouTube. Oh well, yes, we're on we're on YouTube five days a week, Monday through Friday at Buffalo Potato, and we're on live every day at twelve o'clock noon, showing you guys how to draw with numbers and letters. You are so awesome. I'm adding an artist to my resume. Thanks so much, and stay safe. You did it. Thank you. You too. All right.